Gangen Nira Lesson Uframevna Halskin Ebnis Kalalfa Lesson 5 Basic Verbs The most important part of any sentence is the verb. So far, you've seen verbs in several different forms. The most basic form of the verb, the form you'll find in the dictionary, is called the infinitive. This is the to do form of the verb. In Dangin Nira, infinitives all end in oi. For example, the verb to be is moi, and the verb to thank is kalatulanoi. To use a verb in a sentence, you have to remove that oi and put on an ending. This ending will be made up of two parts a tense part, which tells you when the action was done, and a person part, which tells you who did the action. There are four persons in Dangin Mira. The first person describes the speaker. It is the I-We form. The second person describes the person you're talking to, the You form. The third person describes a specific individual or thing, or set of individuals or things that you're talking about, the he, she, it, and they form. The fourth person describes generalities, or unspecified individuals or things, the one or someone form. The person part of the verb comes at the very end, and is denoted by a consonant. The first person, I, we, takes an S at the end. The second person, you, takes an M at the end. The third person, he, she, it, they, takes a K at the end. The fourth person, one, takes a ZR at the end. This is pronounced ZR. Now before this person part comes the tense part. The most basic tense you can use is the present tense. This is denoted by an O. So a first person present tense ending would be OS. Likewise, second person present would be OM, third person present would be OK, and fourth person present would be OSER. Now you have all the tools to conjugate any verb in the present tense. Let's start with MOI, to be. First person, MOS, means I am. Second person, MOM, means you are. Third person, Mok means he, she, or it is. Fourth person, Moser, means one is. The first three persons can all be made plural by adding a special word before it, eb. By adding eb before a verb or noun, you make it plural. So, eb mos means we are, eb mom means you all are, and eb mok means they are. You don't pluralize the fourth person because that doesn't make sense. You can't really specify a number if you aren't describing something specific. Let's conjugate another verb. Let's try a new verb. Niskoi, to do. First person, niskos, I do. Second person, niskom, you do. Third person, niskok, he, she, or it does. Fourth person, niskozer, one does. And then we can pluralize these first three. Ebniskos, we do. Ebniskom, you all do. Ebniskok, they do. Now the present tense in Dangan Mira is really a present progressive tense, so it is best translated in English as such. Niskos is really I am doing. Niskom is really you are doing. Niskok is really he, she, or it is doing. And niskozer is really one is doing. Let's try one more verb. Letoi, to walk. First person, letos, I'm walking. Second person, letom, you're walking. Third person, letok, he, she, or it is walking. Fourth person, letoser, one is walking. Plurals, ebletos, we're walking. Ebletom, you all are walking. And ebletok, 
their walking. For practice, try conjugating these two verbs on your own. Voi, to use, and alioi, to jump. Post them as comments on the video if you like, and see how well you do. That's enough for one video. Please join us for the next one.